Indra, like the party burning girl. Why you? You in the blasted bedroom again listening to music? Take it off, man. I fed up tell you when your cooking is to keep your tail in the kitchen. Next thing you know, the bhaji bun and is me your father go quarrel with. And take your time and cook the roti, eh? You know how it does swell when you have to cook it. You wash out the lotter that your father just put the flowers in and polish it. Well, answer no! Yes, yes, I polish it. And how much time I tell you to keep your tail in the kitchen when you're cooking? It's and bun, it's already water that boiled down. Look, I know when food bun eh, and that smelling bun to me. And you know your father don't like them kind of music in the house and you still playing it? He's only bhajan you must listen to. Not this set of film music that you like. And you know why you and that no good brother of yours and take after Rajendrana? He's the only one who ever do anything to make me proud. Eh eh, what you doing? And how you home? You ever know me to go anywhere? It's only the home and the man there for me. And maybe little Bhagwat and thing when the pundit presiding. You pot smelling good? I hear trying to teach Indra how to cook. But she heard so hard eh, like she don't listen. Imagine, she cooking. Pot and fire, but she in the bedroom. You ever see things so? It's so with them young people these days. For she head hard, like she can't do nothing I tell you. Imagine, she passed common entrance. Gone to a good government school in San Fernando for five years. And I even get one subject. Huh. The only one of my children who ever do anything is Rajendra. You're proud I hear? Mm. It's two more years again he have and then he go be doctor. But they saw he taken money. Half of the London sellers seen you trying to make you in. But he's all right. Eh? The pond does get on. But what he go do? And what about Sharma? <laughs> when last you see him? Do ask about him, nah? He is a blasted waste. Well, all right. I just wish that these other two would have been more like Rajendra. He have brains and sense. Not like them two of them. And this Indra. Like I go have problems finding a husband for she. But Rajendra go get a nice white girl and marry in England. That is alright if he find a girl he like. Eh? Well, he is the first. Hmm. And he do the best. He's so charmer that make me shame. This set of weed is smoking are good. And he always doing it. And since he turned this rasta, he father want to see him. When last he come here? He come home sometime last week when his father wasn't there. And girl, the head was looking so sink, eh? I say it's a good thing his father went out to do puja. His dad set a bad company he did pick up in the junior sec. And start smoking that set of weed. Next thing you know, he turned rasta. And he never finished school. But even with all of that, eh? He did get a work offshore. Working one week off, one week on. But still, that didn't reform him. You hear about Teacher Bisoon, daughter? No. Which one? Sheila. The one that went to school with Indra. What happened to she? Mm. Well, I hear she pregnant. She what? Is good though. You remember how teacher Bisoon and his wife used to wash them out on people who do wrong? That is why I say it. Damn good for them. You remember how he used to walk around here like if he's the best thing it's having this place? Well, he is the school principal, so he have a right to feel so. But I can't believe that about Sheila. She does always be in and out of here to see Indra. Call she and ask she. I'm sure she know. Indra, come a minute. I'm sure she go know. Yes, mommy. Ain't you wanted to ask she something? You hear anything about Sheila? That she pregnant? No, who says so? Well, 
that is what I hear. And I say, as you is she best friend, you wanna hear something? Me know nothing about that. I sure she know. But she don't want to say nothing. Well, that is she friend anyhow you take it. So who she having this child for? Well, I hear is a boy she went to school with. But me ain't too sure. So, when last you hear from Rajendra? <laughs> we get a letter from him last week. He asking for more money. This thing costing too much. All the money we save, all this almost done. And the land going piece by piece. We go have to sell another piece for him to finish and be doctor. But one go thing, eh? He don't complain about how cold the place is. He don't bother he like before. You going to see Tanti this evening? Girl, it's a good thing you remind me, yes? Look how I done forget. Well, I'm going there now. You ain't want to come with me? Yeah, wait for me. <sighs> Indra, you done cook? No, mommy, I have one more roti to cook. Well, it's about quarter to six and your father ain't come home yet. So when he come, you go take out the food, eh? And when you're done, you go water the peas and the tomatoes. But wait till the sun go down, eh? I go down by Tanti and she not feeling too well now. I ain't go stay too long. All right. Chop the soup. Oh gosh, I, I don't like to talk about them yeah. things. 
Kendra, you ever fall in love? <laughs> oh girl, let me talk about something else now. <laughs> I was only two months pregnant. And it's only the culture as you know. And you know. It's time you experience these things. But, well, I, I don't know how to fall in love. Well, it'll start like this. You see somebody and you want to be with him. You ever feel that way for anyone? Well, yeah. Well, this song is good. Which one? A boy in school? No, you wouldn't know him. Besides, well, I don't even know if it's love. Well, that is how it is that. Tell me about it. Well, you know the bridge you in by the landslide? Well, it have a young boy working there. And I see him through my bedroom window every day. But he never see me. Then, it's for you to make yourself known. And he look different to all the other fellas working there. He good looking? Yeah. Kinda. But you know what strikes me best for this boy? It's every lunchtime. He just pick up his bag go and sit down under the poetry and eat his lunch all by himself. The same poetry at the land next door. Well, it is lunch he bring in. He married, so forget me. No, he look too young for that. But you well watch him? Yeah, no. It's two weeks now watching him, you know, girl. If you know how I like to watch him, eh? He look like a nice boy. So you just only watch. And I is all I can do for now. And why you never go on to up to eat? Your mama was. For mommy and father, see? Look, mommy don't want me I to remain a virgin till I get married. Virgin me I. You is too much a saint for me. That is why you're so old and you have a man. But I'm not old. And I can get a man whenever I want. Well, why you don't get one and show me then? All right. I will show you. Which one? The same one having lunch under the poetry? tree? Yeah. And you have a nice body. How you know that? Well, one day, take off his shirt. <laughs> <laughs> that is all he take off? Yeah. <laughs> and you have a nice, hairy chest. And this looks so good in the drizzle and the yellow pui flowers. Well, you will never get anywhere by just watching. It's safer to watch. And what are you going to do about this child in your belly? I will get married now and I will have a child. You sure you know what you're doing? Don't worry about me. I is a big old man. I only study how to get you and this man together. <laughs> and who tell you I want to get together with this man? If you want a man, it's to go out and get him. I hear that car. Like far come. Well, I better be going now. You know how your father likes me. <laughs> Betty, will you, will you mother, you cook? Yes, pa. Well, bring some food for me, girl, and some water to wash me hands. All right. Well, Indra, I'm going. I will see you. All right. Good evening, pa. Pa, you want a piece of pepper in the sakari? Yeah, put a piece now, girl. Girl takes life after dispute with parents. <laughs> Better than not to put two hands in the backside. Them girl and them they too hot nowadays. Only man they running down. You know. You know it's a good thing in Rana Zona. And as soon as I guess she picks up with that boy in Barak, oh everything will be all right. Yeah, pa, wash your hand. And what are you talking to yourself so for? It's <laughs> just a choppy story in the papers, girl. About some girl now who drink poison because the father didn't like the boy she chose. 
And where your mother? She gone by Tantina. Yeah, a little while now. <laughs> pa, you yeah, see how pretty the poetry looking today? Mm -hmm. That better flower fast, girl. It's for the rainy season to come now, for them barrel and them to pull. It's a shame it don't last for long. It is with us so easy. Pretty. The poetry, it's a nice like long time. Long time, it's plenty nicer. Today, it is so nice. But I still find it so bright and nice and yellow, Pa. The wood and them making good now, Kion. You can sell it to make a few dollars with all them butter and wood lice. And Rajendra next, I always call it for so much money. But, Pa, you ever see the sun seeping through the branches? On a rainy day, how it is just light up the sky? Why do you put on the radio now, girl? It must be high in that song. Time we hear some bajan. Oh, God, everybody film so. Nah, girl, nah, nah, nah. Them film song and them are good. Set up chupinis that I'll be singing. I still like it. <laughs> What kind of music? Who tell you you could come here? Tell you you could come here. The queen home? No, she going by Tansy. Who the hell tell you you could come here? Ain't I tell you to never come here until you change? Look at your head, it's so stink. What's the name Creole? I'm man for all the higher regions, I. Boy, I had no sense. One and ton rasta for nothing a shame to the family. You know, you know, if only he was like Rajendra, <laughs> my only good child. <laughs> 